Hi everyone, my name is Talman, um, part of the Blinded Six Pack here. Uh, some people asked me to make this video to try and explain how I designed the bike rack for my truck. Uh, kind of a short rundown of what we had going on. We have uh, six of us in the family, so that's six bicycles whenever we want to go camping. And some of the options I was looking at just didn't seem to make much sense. Um, didn't really want them on the back of the camper. Um, thought about that but it was you know back behind where I couldn't see what was going on I don't have a camera on the back of my camper so I'm not able to see what's going on back there just the thought of the bikes bouncing around and maybe something getting broke or falling off and not even knowing until you got to your next stop was I didn't like that idea they have options where you can do it on the front of the camper kind of above the hitch two to four bicycles again we needed six of them so that's a lot to try and get in that area and then uh, yeah, kind of this is the option I came up with was to put it just over the bed of my truck so I could still use the storage of my bed and um, not have it down inside of it but elevated above it but not too high that it would hit a bunch of stuff when I'm not pulling the camper. So I'm going to take you through a little bit of what I did and kind of how I came up with it. There really wasn't any plans. I just googled some stuff on the internet, found some ideas that I liked, mashed them all together and this is what I came up with. So I'll take you quick little run through of what I did and try to point some things out. Okay, so here's the back of our camper, 2014 Puma 31 BHSS um, by Palomino. <clears throat> In the back here we already have the spare tire mount uh, and the ladder. My plan was I had thought about I would just take the spare tire and move it over here, flip the license plate up higher and put a bike mount in this area. Um, six bikes on this would have been out quite a ways out into traffic. Uh, this unit already is 34 feet long with the tongue. That's getting pretty long to put an extra six bikes all the way out here. So, uh, and like I said before, we don't have a camera on here, so I'm not able to see what's going on. I just didn't like the idea of bikes being back here without being able to see if something's dragging or something like that. So, kind of what we did here was I used some inch and a half square tubing so this is inch and a half by inch and a half by one eighth thick square tubing and ran it along the bed rails here um, I had it bordered long and I cut some pieces off so the cubes on the end here are uh, one and a half by one and a half by one and a half so it gives me an inch and a half gap all the way down the bed uh, so you're able to tie other things to it use it as a bed rail when you don't have the bikes on things like that. And then the bottom plate that goes down in the stake pocket is available on Amazon and I'll put the links below that it's just a, a bed rail or a stake pocket tie down and I just took the bolt out of it and got a longer bolt to go through everything down into the stake pocket. And then over here, so the length on the side pieces are seven feet long. Um, I just measured um, from bed stake to bed stake, so they're actually not quite 70, I think it's 77 inches is what I cut these at. Uh, just measure on your own truck from the stake pocket to stake pocket and have it cut. Um, the crossbars are six feet wide and I just came up with that number to keep it inside the bed rails when it's not in use, but it's enough room lengthwise across to get all six bike racks or bike carriers across there. And I have a little bit of painting to do, and then I'll show you what it looks like with the bike racks on it. All right, so we're on the next day or two here getting some of my painting done. Um, here's the rails for you. So, so the semi-gloss black. I cleaned and prepped all the metal before I did it. I just painted them all black. They're all done. I also decided to do the caps. I've got them drying here under the lamp. The uh, stake pocket tie down caps that were chrome. I painted them a semi gloss black to match as well. So hopefully it'll all look good. I'll be blacked out on the truck. And now I just have to wait for it to dry and put it all together. The 
bike rack all finished up here. Give you a little sneak peek of what it looks like. There we go. Six bikes can go up on top. Got some one inch or inch and a half plugs off of Amazon. Plug up the holes all the way around here, and then just the knobs, uh, three eighths inch knobs, so that I can take this top part off and leave just the bed rails. So there you go. A little bit of a bike rack for you. And these just lift up, just like that, you put the bike in there, and straps for the front tires. Let me know if you have any questions.